Gentleman has expired. The gentlewoman from North Carolina is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My colleague has raised the provision of the Manager Amendment related to school-based health centers referring children in schools for abortions. Regardless of their position on abortion, most Americans agree that the issue should not be raised at school. The language now in the bill reflects that consensus and would have no impact on adoptions. Mr. Speaker, my background is an educator, school board member, mother and grandmother reinforce, reinforces my belief that students are best served when people at the local level are in control of education decisions. I also believe that education is the most important tool Americans at any age can have. I was the first person in my family to graduate from high school and went to college where I worked full time and attended school part time. It took me seven years to earn my bachelor's degree, and I continued to work my way through my master's and doctoral degrees. From my own experiences, I'm convinced this is the greatest country in the world for many reasons, not the least of which is that a person like me who grew up extremely poor in a house with no electricity and no running water, with parents with very little formal education and no prestige at all, could work hard and be elected to the United States House of Representatives. No legislation is perfect, and that's why I look forward to working with my colleagues to address their concerns and improve the Student Success Act throughout the amendment process. We have a significant number of amendments to consider. Forty-four amendments are made in order by this rule, including over 20 Democrat amendments. Among those is, the ranking, is ranking member Scott's substitute amendment for this legislation and nine bipartisan amendments. I've never one, been one to let the perfect be the enemy of the good. And H.R. 5 is a step in the right direction of reducing the federal role in education, empowering parents, teachers, and local school districts, and increasing local control. That's why I'm a proud co-sponsor of this legislation and urge my colleagues to vote in favor of this rule and the underlying bill. I yield back the balance of my time and I move the previous question on the resolution.